And you say to hell with them. And you renounce allegiance. And you pledge your efforts, your effects, your honor, your life to Alaska. That's how I do. I'm an Alaskan seed. And I, they know it. I told them so to go to hell in every way I can in a nice way. I took the case to the Supreme Court, believing in the Supreme Court, that I'd rather be tried in a whorehouse with a madam as a judge. There's more justice. If they don't like it, they know where they can go. The fires of hell are frozen glaciers compared to my hatred for the American government. And I won't be buried under their damn flag. I'll be buried in Dawson. And when Alaska is an independent nation, they can bring my bones home back to my country. I'm Governor Sarah Palin, and I am delighted to welcome you to the 2008 Alaskan Independence Party Convention in the Golden Heart City, Fairbanks. Your party plays an important role in our state's politics. I've always said that competition is so good, and that applies to political parties as well. I share your party's vision of upholding the constitution of our great state. My administration remains focused on reining in government growth so individual liberty and opportunity can expand. I know you agree with that. We have a great promise to be a self-sufficient state made up of the hardest working, most grateful Americans in our nation. So as your convention gets underway, I hope that you all are inspired by remembering that all those years ago, it was in the same city that Alaska's constitution was born. And it was founded on hope and trust and liberty and opportunity. I carry that message of opportunity forward in my administration as we continue to move our state ahead and create positive change. So I say good luck on a successful and inspiring convention. Keep up the good work and God bless you. The fires of hell are frozen glaciers compared to my hatred for the American government. And I won't be buried under their damn flag. I'll be buried in Dawson. And when Alaska is an independent nation, they can bring my bones home back to my country.